Well, it's that time again, ladies and gentlemen. It's quiff myth time again. Quiff myth time, quiff myth time. Just kidding, but it's coming. Are you ready? No snow on the ground yet, but you can feel it's, it's bitter out here. Anyway, Jordan Schultz, Shore West Realtors, doing my thing, another open house. It is Saturday, the 3rd of December. St. Nick is coming pretty soon to your house. Have you been naughty or nice? That's the question. That's not what this video is about though. We're doing a walkthrough over at 3220 Fence Line Road in Caledonia. Take a look. Bam. Bam. Woo, baby. She's a beaut, isn't she? By the way, disclaimer, okay? I'm gonna just say whatever I think. Everything that I say about this house is my opinion, okay? I don't wanna hear, oh, he used subjective descriptors. This is all my opinion, cause I'm doing the open house, okay? Let's just, uh, let's just deal with that, all right? First and foremost, 3220, fence line road. Look at this beautiful driveway. I mean, gorgeous house. I'm, I'm gonna do a little loop here, just do a little loop. Um, in my opinion, a quiet street. Very, very nice neighborhood. It's chilling out here, right off of Northwestern Avenue. Okay. <clears throat> yes, it's Caledonia. It comes up Franksville, it comes up Racine. I've seen it come up a few ways, but I think it's technically Caledonia. If you look at the taxing authority, beautiful. I mean, this driveway is elegant. It's got this nice little thing on the side. I really like it. And then you head in. Landscaping looks really nice. Just look at how perfectly round those bushes are. <laughs> look at the step. I mean, it's just nice. It's got that, you know, that vibe to it. Through the door. Bam! Now remember, People could be showing up any moment, then I gotta, you know, close it down. But let's let's try to do it justice here. So you walk in, first thing I wanna point out is nice tile floor. This is throughout the kitchen this way. It's actually very um, interesting, kind of caught my eye as I got in here. You're greeted by this staircase, which goes up to the second floor, okay? Most staircases on the first floor go up to the second. They could go down into the basement, um, that's true, but uh, this one right here goes upstairs. Now to my left, I have this beautiful, in my opinion, space where you could, I don't know, have a dining room. Maybe you put a table right there. Maybe you sit at the table. Maybe you and your family love to eat food in a room like this at a table in the middle of the room. Before I get to that beautiful kitchen, I'm gonna do a little 180 here, just to the other side, okay? When you walk in, this would be to your right. Bam, another little living space over here. Very cute, very cute. And then, oh, my lanta. You walk in a little deeper and you have this amazing rock climbing wall. I mean, that's what my kid might think it is. No, it's a beautiful wall. It's got these little stone shelves in it. And of course your fireplace right there. Absolutely stunning. If you have a little puppy or a little cat, you know they're gonna hunker down right there. They're gonna hang out. They're gonna block the heat from flowing into the room. Just kidding, who knows, right? But that's what cats and dogs do sometimes. Another nice, enormous living space right here. And then yes, the kitchen. And this is a kitchen, ladies and gents. Okay, it is a fact that this is a kitchen. And you got some blue going on in here, some blue-brown combinations, okay? And look, I did seven years at Steinhoffel's, baby. That's not a prison, that's a furniture uh, joint. And blue-brown combos is like, like everybody loves it, okay? That's a fact, go fact check it. No, it's gorgeous, we like it. Now check this out. You got this island slash range in the middle of the kitchen. I mean, I don't know if y'all are like, you know, a la flambe type fans or whatnot, but this is where you could have some really fun entertainment activities. You're cooking up a storm. People are watching, they're hanging out. They're having their cocktails, conversing with you. 
trying to grab a little piece of whatever you're cooking, but you're like, no, it's not ready yet. I'm the chef. And then as you move on, sink, stove, dishwasher, refrigerator, cabinets. Okay, let's get a wide shot from over here. You got a chandelier right here. It'd be a nice little table right here, I suppose. So cute. So cute in my opinion. The other opinions of other... Th Let me try that again. Other opinions that don't say the same thing, I'm not concerned with. And then I'm not concerned with. And then you rock in through here. Bam! Laundry room. Laundry room, which gives you a ba bathroom access right here. I'm in the bathroom. I am standing in it. Now I am le Look at this little cute little fixture. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. <laughs> Moving on from there, you have your garage access over here. Let's take a look at the garage. Whoa! Actually very clean. We like it in here when it's clean like this. Automatic garage door opener. Um, looks like some storage up there. <sighs> nice loud echo. Nice two car garage there. A little closet right here, by the way, bam. That door closes, closes automatically, which is nice. And then let's take a little peek outside before we go upstairs into the basement. Remember, people can show up any minute. I'm expecting at least two, 300 people to come in today, so we gotta keep her moving. Nice sliding door to this enormous patio. Look at this patio. Enormous in my opinion. I've seen many smaller patios. This is huge. You could put a hot tub or two hot tubs on this patio or three, four maybe, maybe five or six. Go ahead and fact check it guys. Snopes.com. <clears throat> um, nice backyard, really chilled out back here. Look at this. You got an access point to the garage right there. Um, privacy with the trees. And then look, cornfield back here, I believe. Some kind of agricultural space back here. Makes me think of maybe you get permission to do some hunting on this land right here in case you get one of them nice uh, eight pointers come through in the middle of the right season. Oh, keep your hunting opinions to yourself. Okay, okay, fine. Let's get another wide shot here. Look at this. Look at this. Mm, that's nice. What a nice house. Nice bird feeder up there. Look, speaking of, look at that. An eagle posing in its natural space right there. Wow. He's really cold, so he's frozen right there. No, this is gorgeous. This is nice. We like this. I mean, in my opinion, we like this. And a little swing right there. By the way, there's, you know, I'm just going to say, there's a feature to this house in the basement. You're going to blow your mind. There's a feature in this house in the basement. It's going to be, you're not even ready for it, but we'll get there. Let's head on upstairs. How do I get up there? Oh, yeah, the front. Nice wrap around staircase here all right as you get up we have one two three bedrooms so first of all to my right we have this nice bathroom right here full bathroom nice setup again nice orb floating i mean dangling in the middle of the bathroom i like it Hey, I'm into all that weird stuff, you know what I'm saying? I shouldn't call it weird. It's, you know, it, it, it caught me off guard, okay? Turn over here, you got your first bedroom. Now check this out. Closet, right in front of a closet. <clears throat> back to back closets. I was trying to think of a clever name for that, but I couldn't think of one. Bathroom number two, bedroom number two right here, also known as the pink room or the peach room. Boom. <clears throat> Closet right there. Then you have this landing, by the way, right here. Landing. Now, I've seen these landings used as office, little, little kind of like half offices and whatnot. So 
Um, the sky is the limit, okay? I wonder what you guys would use this landing for after you close on this house with your amazing offer that's accepted today when you call me after watching this video. Then, boom, the master bedroom. Wide shot here. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. So then you have, look at this, a vanity. Now look, I know what you're thinking. Hey, that light's out. That's a quick fix, guys. That's a quick fix. I wouldn't get all bent out of shape about something like that, all right? That's actually a nice vanity built right in right there. Then you got this little walk-through closet right here. Oh, I'm sorry, a little walk-in closet right there. And then wrap around this nice master bath. Look at the blues, the grays, the, t the dual tonalities. I made up that term. Look at the toilet and the sink, how they match in color. This is, you can fit a lot of stuff on this uh, space right here. And of course your stand up shower right there. Whew. This is amazing. Again, 3220 Fence Line Road in Caledonia. Today's December 3rd. Like I said, Jordan Schultz with Shore West Realtors doing the open house, doing the walkthrough thing. I know it's been a while. It's been a bit, dude. I've been hunting, traveling, doing all sorts of stuff. And um, a couple other projects, you know, outside of the world of real estate. I'm not gonna talk about them because I don't like a lot of crossover between this and that, so to speak. I like to keep things mysterious, okay? And then bam, just know that I'm back. I'm back and I'm excited. Here we go, descending into the basement. Ding, ding, ding. Ding, 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 ding. Bam. All right, so. I've seen this kind of before too, where you get like this door right to your left kind of separates the furnished from the, I'm sorry, the finished from the unfinished side. So nice finished spot right here. Lots of shelves along the wall, lots of shelves. This wraps around. You got your under the stairs storage right there or a nice hiding spot. Uh, if you're just feeling like you want to hide over here, you have access to your sump. Look at that. Um, access to your drain right there. Look at this. I mean, for real, this is awesome. So, and a little office thing right here, a little hangout spot, do some work. Set up a laptop right there and then type something up on it. That's, that's what comes to mind when I see a little spot like that. Moving on into the unfinished portion of the basement. Bam, you got access to your heater, water heater right here. Turn around this way, let's get a nice watch. Look at this space, lots of storage space, lots of storage space, do a little walk through here. You got a workbench with storage right here, a pegboard, tagboard, another little kind of hidden spot back here. Uh, ladies and gents, this is a ton of space in the basement, a lot of potential, but where's that feature I was talking about? Look at this, look at this. Guys, this brings me back to like second grade. <laughs> My childhood is coming back to me. Oh, it even has the thing where you turn it if it's a fat pencil or a skinny pencil. <whistles> now guys, that is attached to a portion of the property. Therefore, as far as I know, as far as I believe, that is a fixture of the property that comes with this property. So if 375,000 didn't sound like a deal that was already amazing and almost kind of wild, almost hard to believe such a great price point, keep that in mind that that little feature right there is built in as well. Um, never know when you're gonna need an old school pencil sharpener like that, right? So anywho, there you have it, ladies and gents. Um, beautiful spot, beautiful house. I'm liking it. Let's hope for the best on today's open. Again, you better hit me up if you got any questions, comments, concerns. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, you better subscribe. Subscribe, hit that bell. Drop a comment, share the everything, right? And um, let's let's chat, let's get together. 2022 is almost over. I mean, this is wild, dude. We're in, 
who knows what 2023 is going to bring. You can only imagine, hey? But anyway, Jordan Schultz at shorewest.com or shoot me a text 414-581-6959. You have yourself a wonderful day and let's uh, let's get uh, let's get an offer written. Let's go. Let's go. What are you waiting for? It's time that you move to Caledonia. 3220 Fence Line Road. Peace.